Hi YouTube, this is Mokay Seven Eight Seven. Ignore the background noise. Um, so today's video, you guessed it, old Ironside. Uh, take this tin up from uh, my local tobacconist, Watch City Cigar. Let's start with the basics. Uh, it's a lot of key blend uh, with Orientals, uh, Burley, Virginia, and Kentucky in it. I want to say it's good. Um, before I get to rating it, uh, I want to tell you a little bit more about it. Uh, now, in terms of price, uh, it's on the expensive side. It's only 50 grams, as you can see. Yeah, it's only 50 grams, uh, so it's on the expensive side of 50 gram pipe tobacco tins, um, at least where I live. Um, now, uh, in terms of taste and flavor, it's very, very strong in terms of taste and flavor. Um, this tobacco, if you're not used to Latakia, if you do not like Latakia, do not smoke this tobacco. This is strictly for Latakia lovers. Um, so if you like Virginias or Aromatics, if you like Aromatics, don't smoke this tobacco, you'll hate it. Huh? Um, the taste of it is just so strong, it like makes your tongue numb. I mean, it is like, it's like eating b ground black pepper. It's like if I took some ground black pepper and ate it, that's how strong it is in terms of taste. It will just make your tongue numb. It's like you just doused a bottle of Frank Red Hot Sauce on your tongue. Um, but having said that, it, it's good in terms of taste. I like it. Maybe because I like Latakia, I really do like it. Um, in terms of room note, it's it's a nasty, nasty smell. Uh, kind of smells like incense, according to some people. You know, church incense. Um, and it, I mean, when you breathe in, I was in the garage smoking it with the door closed. It is like breathing in pepper gas. It's nasty, the smell of it. Um, it's like when you fry, like, you know, peppers in a frying pan. And um, it's like that kind of vapor. It's nasty. But again, it's good. It's very good. Um, has a very good Latakia taste. Um, in terms of nicotine, my local tobacconist said, um, you know, great guy, uh, said it was going to pack a fairly good nicotine buzz, uh, but, um, you know, um, which kind of worried me because I don't really like the feeling of nicotine. I really don't like the feeling of getting a nicotine buzz. So, um, that kind of worried me a little bit, but it's not terrible. I mean, I, I know a lot of you out there like the feeling of nicotine. Some, some of you don't. Some of you are in between. Some of you like the feeling of cigarettes, but not pipes. I don't know. Um, overall, the head rush from it is not terrible. It's kind of a little annoying. It kind of makes you a little dizzy, but um, it's not overwhelming. It's it, it's it's manageable, so it's tolerable. Um, now, in terms of overall rating, I'm going to have to give it a, probably a 9 out of 10. It's, it's very good. Uh, very, very good. Um, uh, another thing about it is uh, it burns very long. It's a flake. Uh, let me just show you. Um, uh, never mind. Um, it's, you know, you've seen it. Um, yeah, it's a flake cut, and... Um, I mean, flake cuts burn slow enough with Virginia's, but I mean, when you get a lot of Kia flake cut, this burns so slow. I mean, I mean, it is a good, a good 50 minutes to an hour and 15 minutes of smoke. Very long lasting. Um, very good tobacco. I'm gonna have to give it a nine out of ten. The only reason I don't give it a nine and a half out of ten is because it really does make your tongue numb. It doesn't really give you tongue bite. But it gives you a really numb feeling on your tongue. Uh, it does kind of make you a little dizzy. So um, I would recommend smoking, smoking this on a, full, on a full stomach. Let me show you it again. And again, it is a little expensive. It's t almost thirteen dollars. So I mean, almost thirteen. Uh, that's about three dollars more than like Frog Morning or Virginia Woods. So uh, until next time, see you guys later. Peace out. Bye.